A while back, I was driving through Minneapolis, Minnesota, and like usual, I stopped at the local grocery stores, maybe ethnic food stores, to see what I can pick up that's unusual and I can't get in my area. I stopped at a Eastern European food store, and I found these, among some other things. Damaris, lightly smoked sardines in sunflower oil. It's a delightful little design on the box. I love it. It's the smaller kind of package. 3.17 ounces. So it's not so it's not the overwhelming portion of the larger sardines because the fact is people who love sardines usually don't have partners that share that love. So you end up having to consume it all yourself. And a whole tin of sardines, the usual four ounce size or larger, is perhaps a little bit much for the average person. I love this box though, except it doesn't have the reclosable lid. I prefer to have the ones that you can reclose. Not that I'm going to ever reclose them, but it's just something about having that. And things that are in boxes, it makes it Christmas-like. It's like a package that you received a special gift. And this one, as well, is artistic. Although that looks a little bit more like a flying fish than a sardine. Delamaris, 1879. You know, it seems like a lot of the sardine companies began in the middle to late 1800s. Now this one, oh, look at that. It's the jitterbug version of printing on that for old people. I can read that from a couple feet away. Nutrition facts. Two servings per container. Okay, that's questionable because, yes, it's smaller. And we don't want to overeat, I suppose, really rich foods. But still, yeah, two servings. Maybe as appetizers, yes. 204 calories. What would it take to bump that over the edge and make it 205 or lean it up and get it right down to about 201 calories how do they really determine calories to that precision not likely i won't read you all the fun facts in there because it's typically the same for all of them but i will read this the ingredients sardines and sunflower oil ingredients sardines in parentheses fish if you didn't know and of course there are people who don't know Sunflower oil, edible salt, because you wouldn't want to use road salt. It's really coarse. You might actually break your teeth biting down on one of those bits. And they've got chlorine and ethylene. No. And they've got this blue color on road salt to make it pretty. Smoke flavor. No additives or preservatives. Gluten-free. Keep refrigerated after opening but refrigerate it in the outside refrigerator or in your garage because it's going to stink everything up and use within one day. Best before date is on the packaging. Delamaris Foods is from Pivka, Slovenia, produced in Croatia. I'm not real familiar with the Balkan countries there. Slovenia and Croatia, I think, are different countries, but we'll edit that out if I'm wrong. Country of origin, Croatia, imported by Krenos Foods, Bronx, New York. That pretty much covers it. Let's dig in. Nice. You ever do that? It's like you're tapping on a solid chunk of metal. There's something about tapping on solid chunks of metal that says to me, value. Because metal is not cheap. Although this is not full of metal, but still... It just says something to me. This is a good one. There's a number seven stamped in there. Nothing else of note.
where it'll take a peak before I drain the oil out. And again, one of the benefits of heating outside Unfortunately, I inadvertently dumped all that flammable, odorous liquid onto my firewood pile. Let me not forget that when I go grab onto one of those pieces of wood. The top on this one rolls back real easy, and it comes off with a good click. Those are very presentable. There's just something about seeing them alternating tail to tail, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Really neatly done. Like these people really cared about their fish. They really want you to like their product. And as you can see, we've got skin. No scales, because these are the little sprat kinds. I'm going to have to hold them right up so you can see them. They're even packed with the backs on this side, with the backs on this side, and the bellies on that side. Man, they really put some effort into the packing. Nice job. So the first impression is leading me to believe this is going to be a good experience. And you roll it up there, and you roll it back down. Looks good. Looks like there may be some bonus content in this one. Oh yeah. These come with the extra entrails. So either that was a uh, an anomaly that passed the gut checker, or they just come with extra organs which by the way is excellent for the human body the organs contain a lot of vitamins you don't get out of just the regular meat i believe they also have a little collagen in them in case you missed your collagen degree after high school really having a hard time here all right let me shove my glasses back up. Not a burst of flavor, but it's good. It's not overwhelmingly powerful. These are definitely the good, more flavorful, small ones. Seems like the smaller the sardine, the more flavor is packed in it, ounce for ounce, gram for gram, kilo for kilo. But I believe I could enhance the experience by putting two fish bodies where previously there was only one. You'd think for a guy who can successfully juggle, he could also success. He could also just as successfully place these motionless minnows onto a cracker. All right.
meaty. Just moist enough, not dry. Firm, but not chewy or rubbery. Mid-range flavor. Just right for a Sunday afternoon gathering. Not robust enough to eat at lunch when you get out of work. Not robust enough to eat at lunchtime when you're just craving for something exciting. Delamaris sardines, lightly smoked in sunflower oil. Product of Croatia. Definitely worth the money, a great value, an excellent experience. Thanks for watching.